What's up guys? Today in our productivity series, we're going to go over the Pareto Principle, more commonly known as the 80-20 rule. So if you haven't heard about this rule already, it states that roughly 80% of the effects come from 20% of the causes. And this rule is wildly popular because you can literally apply it to almost every aspect of life. For example, in business, it's a general rule of thumb that 80% of your sales come from 20% of your customers. And in school, maybe 80% of your grade comes from 20% of your tests and assignments. And on YouTube, 80% of your views come from 20% of your videos. And you can keep going and apply this rule to so many different areas of life. And it's really interesting how it just works that way. So what do you do with this newfound knowledge? Well, in productivity, you can say that 80% of your results come from 20% of your effort. And you always want to try to be more efficient and effective with your efforts to get better results. So look at your life and see where you can apply the 80-20 rule. Then find out what makes that 20% in whatever it is you're looking at and once you know your 20% focus on it and prioritize it above everything else because that's how you're going to get more output and better results from your inputs. In the 4-hour work week, Tim Ferriss talks about how he cut down his work week from over 50 hours a week to just four hours a week and he did this by applying the Pareto principle. So he focused on his 20% of the tasks that brought in 80% of his income and the rest he just cut out or offloaded to outsourcers. And he continually focused on the 20% and 20% and 20% so that he would get the most bang for his buck out of his efforts and get optimal results. So the 80-20 rule is very powerful and everybody can use it. You can use it today. You can start looking at your life and seeing where you can apply it and where you should focus your time and your energy. That's it for today. If you have more tips on how to be productive, I'd love to hear them in the comments. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!